Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So I recently went shopping to the Metro Centre with my sister Jess and I thought I would show you what I got. Um, so I've got quite a big bag to go through. The majority is clothing, so I'm going to do a little try on for you. Um, but I did get a few beauty bits, so I thought I would go through them first before I get changed into the different clothes. Really nice day out, I did vlog some of it. We had our first Wagamamas. Um, but yeah, I just thought I would show you what I got. Um, I've got a little Starbucks drink to keep me going. I got this from the gym for free actually it's the double shot espresso um little can and it tastes really good i thought i was gonna have to put some syrup in it but off with the beauty bits so firstly bath and body works i am obsessed i love bath and body works obviously it's mainly in america and recently next started stocking it um so for christmas now it's a tradition i ask for a bath and body works three wick candle um but i went in and got a couple of their hand sanitizers because how cute are they obviously youtubers like zoe so do little hauls of bath and body works or you know when they go to like new york and stuff and i don't know if i'll ever go to america because i'm scared of flying so <laughs> this is the closest i'm gonna get um so i just picked up two little hand sanitizers because i've actually not really got any hand sanitizer at the minute can you remember when it literally was out of stock everywhere and it was a craze the same with toilet rolls like the fact that that was three years ago is just mental to me um but yeah i picked up two little hand sanitizers which are in the sale so i got eucalyptus rain which is like a pretty green color and then strawberry kiwi which i've already smelt it i love the smell of this one and this one's a little pink one and then also on sale they had their little like holders so i got a green one because i'm really loving green at the minute so yeah i just thought they were cute so i only spent like six pound i think like to buy a lot more but my bank card said no um so that's everything i got from bath and body works i then got a few things from Superdrug, so i'll just get them out the bag I got some sort fragrance body mists. I really love this brand and I just like to have a little body mist in my handbag. I take one to work with me, have one just like in the house for before I go out. Um, and these were really cheap. I think it was like two for six pound. So I got wild berries and watermelon because I really like fruity scents. Um, these are the smaller bottles. You can get bigger ones, but I just thought they would be handy, like I said, to go in my handbag. A couple of beauty items. A collection we have the Vitamin Fix Brow Gel um i thought this packaging was just so cute and summery i'm not that fussy with a brow gel as long as it does the job i've actually used it today i like that and it was quite affordable and from nyx i got the lip drip fat oil which i've seen all over tiktok so i'm really excited you know what i might actually try it now um i got this one in the shade blow back and just look at that color it's like really glittery kind of nude and um, so i thought that would be really pretty oh Oh, and it smells really good too. Oh my God. Let me get my mirror. Oh my God, I'm obsessed. Love the colour of this. This is definitely going to be my new favourite lip gloss. So I've got that from Superdrug as well. Sorry, just look at my lips. Uh, moving on to fashion, we're going to go for Primark. Now, me and Jess made a very, very bad decision. We went to Primark first, so then we were carrying around our massive bags on our shoulders. I was literally in pain when I got home. And then I picked up, literally last minute, the till. Um, this little travel bag, I mean, I did buy it because it looks cute, I'm not going to lie. But I thought I would put it away for my summer holiday in October. Um, I thought if I start buying little bits here and there, then I don't have to rush and buy everything before the holiday when I've probably got no money left. Um, so yeah, this is just a little travel bag. It was £5 um, and it's got some little like pots and bottles to pop skincare, sun cream, things like that in there. I thought the little bag was really cute. Um, so yeah, I picked that up. I then got a handbag. I was undecided whether to buy this or not. It reminds me of a handbag I had a few years ago, which was green and it had a very similar strap um so it was one of those things that just felt a little bit nostalgic to me like i used to really love little bags before little bags were a thing um and i had a few and yeah this reminded me of one of my old ones but this is blue and i really love the like texture and the color i just thought it was a really pretty bag i had to buy more neutral clothing so that i can accessorize with pops of color and yeah i just thought this was really cute i do think that has a chain inside as well um and i thought it was a nice size like it's not too small because some of the mini handbags i've actually got one i've actually got one here this one i also got from Primark ages ago i mean this is ridiculous like i can literally fit my bank card 
and maybe a lip gloss in there like that's it and i mean to be honest that's probably all i need sometimes but that is like extreme mini um so i feel like this is a nice size handbag and it's pretty much it does feel like good quality it was nine pound and there is a little zip on the inside as well and if i take the little bag out oh we've got a strap not a chain i did think it might be a metal chain which i don't like on a handbag like i don't mind a metal handle but i like an actual like material strap so i'm happy with that but yeah i just thought that was so cute i love this little handbag i didn't think this through because i'm bloody sweating it's really really sunny outside and now i have to try clothes on <sighs> anyway i got this little like sheer cardigan thing and um, it was in the sale for six pound i got it in a medium and i tried it on took a picture and then didn't buy it for the rest of the day i kept thinking about it and i sent it to people and put it on my instagram story i was like should i go back for it and i did i went back for it i don't know if this is smaller than the one i tried on because it feels a little bit smaller but i think it's cute i'll just tie it at the front just thought it was cute i really love this color obviously just paired with a little white t-shirt um i think it looks quite cute on my joggers but equally with jeans or when i'm on holiday with some little denim shorts i actually picked up some denim shorts i might try that on next but i thought for six pound i just thought it was a really fun little piece we will wear it loads but i think it is a really nice cute outfit and if i went to like any like concerts or festivals or something i think this would be really cute so let me know what you think i'm going to just try on the shorts now these were eight pound i got them in a 16 so i'll just pop them on just put the camera down um so these are the shorts i really like the little frill detail i got so i did get them in a 16 there is quite a bit of room i thought especially for holiday when i'm living my best life eating everything i'm gonna need a bit of extra room i really like the color as well and as i said i just think it goes really nice with this little top um so yeah i just thought they would be a nice staple piece in my wardrobe the only other shorts i have at the moment are a darker denim and like a mom jean style um so i wanted something a little bit different to go with different tops and things really nice material as well so they are the shorts so something i didn't expect to buy cargo pants but i absolutely love these so they're in a charcoal grey colour, they're from Primark, I got them in a medium and they were £18. I tried them on literally just to see if the style suited me, which I didn't think it would, um, as I didn't expect to like them and buy them. Um, but I really like the material, they're really soft, obviously as I said I've got a medium, but there is quite a lot of stretch in them. Um, I'm really petite, I'm only five foot, um, but they have like little bits at the bottom, which I probably won't be able to show you, but you can adjust them to make them more like cuffed. So that way, obviously, when I'm wearing like bands or trainers, they're not going to be trailing on the floor because um, I can tighten them up. The same with this bit here. Um, but yeah, I think they're really cool. They've got like the different pockets on. I feel like cargoes are one of those things that like, I just didn't think I would be able to pull off. But I actually think they look quite cute. Um, so yeah, some little cargoes, which... I think, assuming cargo stay in fashion, I feel like these would last me a long time. This in my last video, but I am eating better and I am gradually losing little bits of weight here and there. Um, so although I'm not like on a diet to lose loads of weight, I'm buying clothing. I'm a little bit more mindful that I want them to fit for as long as possible. Um, so I'm not getting anything too baggy. So I'm really glad that I got the medium. Um, but yeah, I'm really happy with them. I can't wait to style them. I think they're gonna look really cool with like bands and trainers and little tops. Um, quite trendy i'm not even gonna lie so yeah some little cargoes okay next we have a dress so this is a black and white gingham dress i absolutely love this i've been looking for a dress in this pattern for the longest time literally years the same with the dress that i showed in my other recent haul and um, from matalan which was like a long white dress with black polka dots they are two dresses I've been looking for for ages because I feel like they're really classic um, like styles. They're dresses that are just never going to go out of fashion. Um, and I've always struggled to find something in those patterns that suit my body. Um, but I'm really happy with the style of this one. So this one was £16. I got it in a 14. Um, and yeah, I just really love it. It's really comfortable. Um, it's got like little cuffed sleeves and like a v-neck. Um, and yeah, I really like it. And I think it will look so cute with some chunky black sandals um, and like some sunglasses and a handbag for summer. But equally, cannot wait to pair this with some tight 
chunky black boots and a knitted cardigan for autumn like i can't wait yeah i'm just ready for autumn now um but yeah i just thought this is a really nice classic dress that i think as i said would just never go out of fashion and it will be something that i always reach for in my wardrobe so i feel like the purchase is just so much more justified when it's something that i have been wanting for a long time as opposed to something that's just come in fashion which i like the look of and i just kind of buy it on a whim um so yeah really love this dress happy break so a few bits from H&M, firstly this jumper, I am obsessed, um, I really like F1, like I don't like football or anything but F1 is something that I actually enjoy watching, um, my dad would always watch it when we were having Sunday dinner like when I was younger, I don't know if he still watches it but James watches it, um, so I watch it sometimes with him, I'm not like a die hard fan, I really support a certain team so when I saw this I thought it was perfect because it's just a general F1 jumper um, I've never seen H&M do anything like this before but I just thought it was a really nice little collaboration that they've done um, so this jumper is so comfy and soft um, it's a really nice material I think I'm going to wear it to the airport when I go on holiday in a size small because the medium was just a little bit too baggy for me um, I also got these shorts which are just some plain black cycling shorts I got them in a pack of two you got a ribbed set and just some plain ones um, and they were 9 99 which I thought was a really good um, price for two pairs of shorts um, and yeah I just really love this jumper it was like 20 something pound I think it was 27 99 but it's definitely a jump I'll keep literally forever like especially if me and James go and watch the F1 together I would definitely wear this I also got a F1 t-shirt so I'll pop that one on now okay this is the t-shirt again really like this just a basic black t-shirt with a logo got this again in a size small and it's just a really nice casual baggy tee um again paired with the cycling shorts i just think this is a really nice you know comfy look um you know to go out but also equally just for like lounging in the house i always do this to myself i have to get in really awkward positions to see how much it was uh 14.99 which i don't think is too bad for an f1 top to be honest um so yeah i really like this and i just feel really cool not gonna lie um it's really comfy i think james would definitely like wear this to be honest if he could but yeah i really like this again really nice soft material and very comfortable um i also got a little necklace from h&m i'm gonna put the camera back up actually because i'm literally crouching down here I got this little necklace which I thought was really cute um, and it's just like a little planet it's black and gold and yeah I just thought that was really cute. I don't have a lot of jewellery anymore so I do need to stock up on some but I just thought that was so sweet. They had like a little butterfly one as well um, but I just thought the planet was much more me um, and that was just 3 99 so how cute is that um, and I think that's everything so thank you for watching if you haven't already please do go and subscribe um i've done a lot of shopping recently so there's been quite a lot of hauls i definitely need to stop spending money now I do plan to have at least one or two kind of fashion hauls a month um from now onwards so if that's your kind of thing then do stay tuned for that um i will be doing some instagram reels and tiktok videos showing you the clothing items that i've got now and then in my other hauls and kind of like how i styled them if you want to see the outfits i put together then do do follow me on them as well i'll leave everything linked below and i will see you in my next video